hello welcome once again to my channel in this video i will show you how i cook obono soup nigerian obono soup exactly what you see on the screen let's dive into it everyone here are my ingredients i have dry asa fish and stock fish it is properly washed then i have seasoning to taste then i have crayfish or blended dry prawns then i have palm oil or red oil keep watching and see how i prepare this delicious abala soup i have dry chili pepper to season or spice of this recipe then i have blended obolo keep watching don't go away see how i prepare this delicious urban soup you see at the beginning of this video everyone all right then i have some freshly chopped onions watch and see what i do with this freshly chopped onions on this recipe then this obolo soup will be cooked with assorted meat half there in the bowl some cow tail cow legs and cow skin or more then i have beef yeah this is already parboiled then i have some cow skin dies in a smaller shapes and also big shape then this very obolo soup yeah i have salt to taste this obolo soup will be cooked with ozuza leaf have you ever cooked ozuza use ozuza leaf to cook obolo soup before if you've not please after this video try it it gives this nice taste nice flavor to your obolo soup so to start i place my pot on fire then add my assorted add dry fish and stock fish add my freshly chopped onions everyone so i'm using the onions to buy to boil this seasoning to test some dry chili pepper to test some salt to test then because the assorted is parboiled already i will add some water i'll go ahead and add some water and allow it to cook for 15 to 20 minutes on a medium flame so why that is on fire here is how i prepare my oziza leaf everyone so i'll take my time to pick it out the leaf out from the i always call that the stain everyone i don't know what it really is so i'm going to be plucking out the leaves from it and after plucking this is what it looks like i'm going to watch this off camera keep watching don't go away don't watch half watch to the end so you understand how i prepare this albono soup recipe everyone so after washing this is how i cut my ozuza leaf for obolo soup everyone do this if you have this energy but if you don't take your knife and slice it into your desirable shapes but i love to use my hands to cut it so i can see it in the obolo soup everyone all right so after cutting it this is what it looks like i will set this aside and keep cooking so everyone let's keep cooking so after 20 minutes you see that um the assorted the stuffed fish everything is almost ready so i'm going to add just one full cup of water and continue cooking and not making much about soup it's just one time eating for the family so add yours depending on the quantity of the obolo soup you want to make so after adding it up i have to cover a lot to cook oh i forgot to add crayfish so i will add crayfish now four tablespoons of blended crayfish or prawns then cover to cook for 15 minutes on a high flame while that is aside on a clean pot after it gets dry i'll add my palm oil and bring it to a cook a boy please we're not cooking the palm oil or blanching it once it gets hot the next thing i do is to start adding my blended obono bit by bit why i use this method to cook my obono soup is because i do not want obono lumps on my soup i want that smooth soup so 
do this it is very very nice it gives your bolo soup a nice flavor and you eat it smoothly no lumps so i'm going to be stirring this for at least five minutes on a very low flame until it melts until all the lumps from the obolo melts away okay make sure your flame is on the low side so it does not boil or begin to overcook so keep watching if this is your first time here you are highly welcome and if you're returning thanks for returning please don't forget to like comment subscribe and share my video to your friends and family please if you've watched my video up to this point and it is your first time please don't forget to hit the subscription bell i mean yeah the subscription bell and all the ingredients used for this video will be at the description box down below the quantity everything so why that is aside let's keep cooking now the meat stock everything is almost ready so at this point i will be adding the already stirred obolo soup into this pot bit by bit and as i add i will carefully stir it or tenderly stir it to combine stay until it blends properly with the stock exactly what you see me doing on the screen so i'm adding it bit by bit everyone hello don't forget to subscribe and don't go away watch to the end so our soup must bubble like this if it does not bubble like this then it is not our soup everyone wow it's the aroma of this soup is taking over the whole kitchen everyone so after um, allowing it to cook for five minutes the next thing is to add my already prepared ozuza leaf and stir to combine everyone hello all my jenny subscribers thank you so much for your wonderful support always so our obolo soup nigerian obolo soup is almost ready everyone you can see it's super yummy at this point i'm thinking of the swallow to go with fufu even amala <laughs> samovita pounded yam the choice is yours because here i'm gonna be eating it with any swallow of my choice too so our abono soup is ready thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe like comment stay safe stay connected Bye for now. Yeah, bye.